Hello everyone. So welcome to the channel of RD Automation Learning. So in this video, we'll be sharing with you a few of the testing job opportunities for freshers as well as for experience. But before that, let me share with you about the details for the ServiceNow company. So ServiceNow company is hiring for both software development engineers as well as for SDET roles. So they are looking for experienced people. That is, uh, if you are having five years of experience, then you would be eligible for SD three kind of role. So minimum experience required is two plus years of experience. So yesterday in the live session, many of you were asking if there are any job opportunities for two plus years of experience, so you can apply to these particular companies. So they are hiring for SD one, SD two, SD three, SD four, apart from that SD one, two and three. So here are the details for the software engineer two plus years. And here are the details for senior software engineer five plus years that they are looking for big data service now developers for UI UX and for staff software engineers. A lot of job opportunities are there. And let's focus on the quality engineers. So you can see there are multiple job opportunities. They are looking for experienced people with two plus years of experience, five plus years of experience and eight plus years of experience. So I'll be putting this links in the comment section of the video itself. Apart from that, they are also looking for machine learning engineer, machine learning quality engineer, then tech support roles, data scientist. Again, in data science, they are looking for uh, juniors as well as for experience. So you can see senior data scientist and data scientist. Similarly for big data and for database engineer. So these are all the job opportunities for ServiceNow company. They are doing mass hiring. Apart from that, the other job opportunities which are there, let me share with you. Yeah, so Flipkart is hiring for women who are looking for the tech roles. So today is the last day. Today is Monday. Today is the last day to enroll for this particular link. This is the form link and it would be closing on Monday. They are looking for SD1 as well as for development kind of roles for UI UX, any engineering students who have uh, passed out from the batch of 2024 uh, women, they can apply to this particular roles. So eligibility is open to women engineering students who are graduating in 2024 with specialization in computer science, information technology, mathematics, electronics and communication. And the cutoff is 7.5 and above. Apart from that, Advantel Technologies Private Limited is hiring for freshers. The work location is Indore and the interview date would be from 3rd to 5th of June. So now you can apply to these particular uh, things and uh, this particular link and you will be getting one kind of assessment once that assessment is done or maybe you might be directly called for the walk-in interviews which is there in the first week of June itself. So if you are a 2020 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024 graduate, you can apply to this particular link. The qualification is B, B Tech, CSIT, BCA, MCA, MEM Tech. So good job opportunities for freshers in the Advantel Technologies Private Limited. Then in Noida, the QAs, they have got the internship opportunity. So it's a six months internship. They are looking for QA engineers trainee and the duration would be six months. You can share your CV at HR at the rate of hexadecimalsoftware.com. This would be the stipend and it is a work from office role. So here is a job description that they have mentioned as a QA engineer trainee at hexadecimal software. You will play a crucial role in ensuring the quality and functionality of the software. So they are looking for manual testers. Apart from that, it performed. Okay. So you can, you can have a good con knowledge on manual testing, but know some basic concepts of automation as well because in the second line they have mentioned perform manual and automated testing so these are the responsibilities that you would be doing as a part of internship right and these are the requirements bachelor's degree in computer science engineering or a related field experience on understanding of business problem solving skills experience with manual automated testing so as it's an internship, you can go with the knowledge of manual testing and automation testing that should suffice. Okay, so these were a few of the job opportunities for freshers as well as for experience. You can apply to these particular companies today itself because in couple of the companies, Monday was given as the last day to apply. 
So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching this video and stay tuned for more updates.